Hey, what's going on TikTok? Michael here. Welcome back to another video. Today's video is exclusively for TikTok, and I will be making a video follow-up shortly for YouTube. But today we're going to be taking a look at a brand new unit that has come into the Technoid Studio. I am, of course, talking about the Interval 3-in-1 wireless charger with MagSafe compatibility. I just want to let you guys know that they were kind enough to send this video and make it possible by sending this out. But again, guys, they have no say in my video. They're seeing the video at the same time you are, so they have no say. They have no affiliation on what I say or my opinion. This particular charger I want to talk about with you guys because it is not only a very good charger, but I've had a very good experience with it. For starters, the biggest positive right out of the gate is the form factor. This thing is incredibly small, compact, but yet does the job very nicely. I'm going to put it on here for you to see. It has a nice wireless charging pad surface with MagSafe right on here, so you can put your iPhone on in MagSafe. It does give you the MagSafe pop-up. In the back, we have the Apple Watch charger, and then at the bottom of the base, we have a light that does add a nice little feature to it, which is a nice perk, but also gives you another cheap pad to charge your headphones or any headphones that support wireless charging. Now, in regards to the charger itself, it does cap out at around 20 watts max. So inside of the box, it gives you the included cable and the charging brick. So you should definitely take advantage of that when you get it. And one of the biggest things that I really like about this charger is the fact of convenience. Again, I really like that it's so small and minimal, but yet so powerful. Not only does it charge my iPhone very good, it does a very good job with heating, cooling, and also just giving it a nice form factor and minimal design. It does support standby mode, so that means if you put your phone sideways, it goes into standby mode. So if at night you do wake up and move around, you can see your clock and pictures and other things. The Apple Watch charger works very well. It works with my Apple Watch Ultra. I had no problems with it at all. And lastly, the base charger for your headphones also worked very nice. I really like the display light that it puts on. I think it does a very, very good job, and I actually really enjoy this. The only negative that I have, which... I've been testing is that I did wish that it was a little bit faster in regards to the charging speeds but it does a phenomenal job with doing three devices at one time so I'm not even too worried about it and considering nowadays that you want to kind of protect your phone battery it's probably a better thing to charge it at a little bit of an easier speed than trying to go super super fast because my battery degrading has gone down pretty bad so uh, this could have definitely helped out but all in all, it is a phenomenal charger. I think it does a great job. I don't have any complaints. I think the only complaint, again, was just the charging speed, but I think it's actually doing a very good job of managing, and it also does a very good job with cooling the unit and also keeping my phone, my watch, and headphones at a nice temperature. So I'll leave a link in the description if you want to check out this charger. I hope you guys enjoyed this video. This was very quick, straight to the point. This is my first ever TikTok review. I hope you enjoyed it. If you did, hit the like button. If you disliked the video, you can hit the dislike button. That helps circulate my videos as well. As always, everyone, thank you so much for watching. I will see you all on the next episode. Have a great rest of your day, guys. Take care. Stay safe. Have a good day. And peace.